Okay, so um, the tool I'm going to show you today is something that can help you with um, the uh, syllabus reading objectives. So um, what I'm going to start you off with is um, a page from the uh, curriculum guide. This is um, the syllabus objectives for reading. And um, the thing I'll show you today is going to be particularly useful for um, awareness raising. So we've got them at basic, intermediate and upper intermediate. Uh, let's just look at some of the objectives, developing awareness of different reading statues for different text types. Okay, that's one that we're going to particularly look at. Okay, so uh, you can find this on page 26 of the curriculum guide, just in case you're interested. All right, let's uh, get down to business. Okay, so um, on Google, we're going to type in higher size. Speed reading software and tools, ISIs. Okay, so you're just going to click here. What happened there? Okay, there we go, ISIs. Okay, that'll take you to the home page, ISIs. All right, so what is this? Okay, there's some brief blurb here. Help you to become an accomplished speed reader. These are the things it claims it will do. Okay, this is um, one that might interest our students here. Get better grades. Alright, so basically this is going to enable you to um, develop speed reading, reading in chunks rather than one word at a time. Um, it's probably just easier if I show you uh, what I mean with a demonstration. So what we want to go to now is tools. Click here. Uh, what I like about this is that you can basically choose any piece of text on the internet and um, you can use this tool to read it according to the uh, the speed that you want. Okay, so we're here. ISI's bookmarklet. Right, now this is the tricky bit. Not too tricky, don't worry. What you need to do here is hover over this. You can see the little hand. Now you press your left click on your mouse and you hold it down and you want to drag it up here anywhere you want it. You see that it's trying to make space for it. There we go. Now you can see a little speed read it. Where it says there, it's now up here. Okay, so um, what we're going to do, go to any page you want. I've just chosen the Guardian's home page. Um, any text will do, so let's just click on the first thing we find. You see it's loading really slowly here because I'm trying to show you this. <laughs> okay, here we come. Slowly, slowly, slowly. Okay. All right, we don't want to look at George Osborne. Okay, let's go down to the text. And now I'm pressing left click and holding down. I'm highlighting a big lump of the text. It's all in blue. And now all you do, you go up to this little button you've made here and press speed read it. Okay, so um, you can see the text that we had before. It's now appeared in the ISI's web page. So you can do this with any text that you highlight anywhere on the internet. Okay, so what do we want to do? Um, basically, um, according to the type of reading you want to do, you can adjust the words per minute. Let's go to what experts think is a fairly reasonable sort of uh, skimming speed. Um, Fixations. This is basically um, the number of uh, the size of the chunk you want. So let's put it at four. It's four words. So it's going to highlight four words, then highlight another four. You'll see as we go along. Fixation points. I think this is um, how many sort of chunks per line. But uh, because I've chosen a big font, it's not that 
it's not going to be much of an issue. Font size, you can make it way bigger or much smaller. Let's choose a fairly reasonable one for this demonstration. How many lines showing? Um, so, I mean, you can you can you can get students to sort of be predicting the content, or you can have the whole text showing, which they might sort of come up to terms with in an exam. Anyway, so um, this is basically it. All right, so let's let's press play, and you'll see what I mean. Okay, so. This is going to be going quite fast, sort of similar to how students will be reading for a skimming. OK, press play. OK, so you can see how quickly this is moving along. Um, it's not giving you the chance to read this word by word. OK, so let's stop that. Let's imagine they're doing an ELA reading. Let's go way down to something like this. Um, now you can see uh, look, it's going along at a much slower rating here. It's still trying to get you to read in chunks but okay the whole purpose of your reading here obviously is to read for a greater deep, greater level of understanding. Um, that's basically it. So you can you can fiddle around with all these things but it's it's a really really cool um, application. Um, so let's just go through the process one more time. Let's go back to um, the Guardian's homepage. Eventually. Okay, so click on your text. It's a nice football text for you here. Okay, so can you remember what we did? When you're on the page, just left click, hold down, highlight as much of the text as you want, and then go up to your little speed read it button and click. And this takes your big lump of text into the ISI's um, application. So just while we're waiting for that, just to remind you that this is um, something you can use particularly with this objective. Okay, we've got that objective at each level. So this is a tool. I mean, obviously, you're going to have to find a text suitable for each level, but this is a really nice tool for um, raising awareness of how you can read for particular reasons. Okay, all right, we want to go through this really quick. Oh, oh, let's have a look at what 970 words per minute looks like. Yeah. Um, I'm not going to get much from that, but <laughs> you can see how flexible this tool is anyway. Okay, so where you're going is just isis.com, and we clicked on the tools. You drag this up here, and then you're ready to go. Just go to um, a website with text that you like and highlight it, and then click on Speed Read It. Simple as that.